Hello everyone, Dilakitsu, and welcome back to some more Pokemon Let's Go Eevee. In the last episode, we managed to do Go Park. We actually managed to catch a total of 51 Pokemon, actually, in the last episode. It was a long one, I'm gonna go ahead and say that. But you guys do know that we normally go to like two different routes in this time of the Pokemon journey. But no matter, we did went through route 11 through 15 to Felosia. And this episode, we actually going to be doing the opposite because we will be, we normally go through Cycling World first. But we decided to go through route 11 through 15. But in this episode, we'll be doing... Not really the cycling road area, it's technically is cycling road, but it's not really cycling road, if you guys know what I mean. Uh, for the people that has played throughout the other games, actually. So that's what we're going to be doing, just going to gain some experience before we make our way over to uh, Silverburn Island, actually. Just had to do some more training before we actually do head out of the mainland of Kanto, actually. But, um, we're gonna be making our way through round 18 here. We got a bullet trainer here. I'll always check every grassy area like this for a new Pokemon. I like my voice. I like your voice. Oh, thank you. I do appreciate it. We got a bullet keeper in Wilton. You got two Pokemon. I need to move my mic here. <clears throat> Because I accidentally hit the mic while trying to get some drinks there. Okay, we got a Pharaoh. Let's do a sizzling slide. Okay, I'm just gonna get a bond then. Pharaoh is born. Pharaoh is gonna use a drill pick. Alright, Pharaoh's gonna get hurt by the bond. Let's go ahead and do. Glittering Glow. Go ahead and faint the Pharaoh here. Light screen has make my team a lot more stronger. We're gonna gain 640 expand points also with the Pokemon that is in my battle. We got a dud duo coming in. Alright, we switch out Eevee. We do got Dragonite and Gengar in the team now. I'm gonna go ahead and say they are a little bit low level, but we actually can see what we can do. Let's see what uh, Dragonite got. You got Thunder Wave, Dragon Waves, Legility, and Dragon Tail. Uh, Gengar got Will of Esp, Dark Post, Tossic, and Saddleball. I don't really know what level these uh, Pokemons are on this route, but we're going to swap out to Charizard here. <clears throat> what level are these? These are level 39s? Okay, so they're about a little bit... about equally leveled, I would probably say, with uh, Dragonite and Gengar. But, um, we definitely had to do some training, actually. The duo is going to use a drill pick there. We did manage to use a fire punch or yeah. Just going to do another fire punch to the, the duo. There we go. The duo is fainted. Charizard is going to gain 643 spam points. The same with the team, the Pokemon team. I think of the 2340 Poke Dollars of Wisdom and the three Pokeballs. Well, at least those, that Dud Duo wasn't really annoying, actually. Got a Dud Duo here. We definitely did not have cats that I actually could have actually transferred from Pokemon Go, but, um,. I'm gonna go ahead and catch this bad boy here. There we go. The duo has been caught. Gonna gain 216 spam points. Alright, we're gonna get Dodrill. Dodrill has been added to the Pokedex. 
Its short wings make flying difficult. Instead, this Pokemon runs at high speed on developed legs. I'm gonna go ahead and add it to the Pokebox. How much do you play Pokemon Go? Uh, I play Pokemon time to time, actually. Whenever I get the chance to. Mostly I do it whenever we on Twilps. Kukuku. How do you like my book haul? It was alright, I gotta say, Bird Keeper. When we roll, you got one Pokemon. Got a Pidgeot. Gonna bring Eevee out. Uh, I feel like that Gengar can probably can take some of these Pokemon out in this episode, actually. But we can use the Sizzling Slide. Pidgeot is gonna get born. Pidgeot is gonna use El Slash. I feel you, I live in a small town and Pokemon Go is so really hard to play. There's also no stops and gyms. There are gyms where I'm at, but I have to like go like across town just to get to them. Pidgeot is gonna faint. But whenever like I'm at, like out of town actually, that's probably like the best time I do it. I should have stayed quiet, but thank you for the 2340 Poke Dollars and the 3 Pokeballs. That plus I have to get rid of some of the Pokemon that is in my storage because I was out of storage actually. Because we do have a trip coming in actually in a, in a few months actually that um, I had to make sure I had to make the room for it. Got another bookkeeper here. This is my tough. Get out of here. Because I do know where we be heading off to. There's going to be a crap ton of gems, actually. Alright, Bookkeeper Jacob, you got three Pokemon. Got a Farfetch. Bring out Eevee here. I kind of wish I didn't, like, leave the city. That's one thing I kind of wish I just didn't do, because moving out here in a small town, there's probably, like, there's only, like, one gym, but there's, like, three to four, uh, poker stops still. But most of the time, whenever I go out of town, I usually try to get my Pokemon into, like, some gym so I can get, like, some gold or something like that. I'm gonna use Glitchily Glow. Alright, Fulfetch is fainted. Light Screen has made the team a lot more stronger. I'm gonna gain 514 expand points. It's also with the Pokemon that is, is in my party. We got another Farfetch. Go ahead and uh, keep the battle. This makeup is not gonna turn it out for me. The type of makeup we put it on, actually. Pie mascara or something like that. <laughs> Gonna use a double edge that will one shot far fetch. That plus Eevee is going to take the recoil damage, 514 experiment points for Eevee, and also with the Pokemon that is in my party. We got a far fetch number three. I'm gonna go ahead and keep Eevee in the mix, and we do another double edge. Quick attack from Farfetch. This very faint Farfetch, I mean Eevee, but it does one shot Farfetch. Eevees take the damage from the recoil, 514 experience for Eevee and also Pokemon in my party. Wah. And thank you for the 2340 Poke Dollars and the three Pokeballs still. Jacob, I do appreciate it. Yeah, uh, Eevee almost died in that battle. But, um, I think we have, oops, a wrong, uh, wrong tab there. Uh, do we have any potions? Matter of fact, we do not. Okay, at least we are still around the Felicia City area. Let's make a little pick stop right quick to, uh, the market. Buy some potions, actually. Do you like smoky, light, glitter, black shadows and stuff? I got the golf style. Oh man. My eyeliner is about to be a mess. I'm 
I was Ooh, we got max potions now. Um, we did spend a crap ton of money on the Ultra Balls for the last episode, actually. So, we only got 43,849 po um, Poké Dollars, so... How much we can actually buy for max potions? We can buy a total of 17. Let's do 10. So we can actually have like a little bit of some money in my pocket. How many revives we got? We got 16 now. Okay, we, we're gonna be good. I hope like eyeliner is like really hard to like do because it's like really dangerous close. Is it like the pencil? Is it like the um... Uh, the um... The brush little thing. Alright. Cycling road? Technically it's not cycling road. I love the music actually. Man, got a trainer here. A path that Pokemon and people in Pokemon walk together. Got a camper here with a Vulpex. You look gentle, so I think I can beat you. I give it a go. I do depend under the, my eye only with waterline. Like if you pull it from the bottom of your eye down, and I do the liquid liner and for wings. Uh, both ends are kind of hard. You have your eye and then <laughs> black tears once a once in a while. But if you get a hang of it, it's much easier. Uh, jab your eye. It's all good. We got a pig nigger here. It is a Masaki. I'm probably pronouncing the whole name wrong. We got three Pokemon. We got a Vulpex here. Yeah, plus, uh, I forgot about EB is actually low on HP, but bouncing bubbles will heal EB up just a little bit. That will definitely be one side. It was super effective. How much health is going to gain? I sure you got EB out of the web, though. Full pigs is. Fainted. 221 expand points for Eevee, not so with the Pokemon that is in my party. We got a Wigglytuff coming in. Alright, let's go ahead and swap out to from Eevee. Let's do Gengar. Do a shoes up boy Gengar here. Gonna see what Gengar can do. Alright, let's do... Dark Post. Hmm. It's not really affected, okay. We just need to try to get some Gengar and some action in anyway. Alright, Wiggly Tough this lawn, uh, Dark Post, whatever move it, Wiggly Tough this did. Uh, let's do Saddle Ball this time. It does not affect the opponent, okay. Wiggly Tough is gonna use Dark Post on me. It was super effective. Okay, um... Will-O-Wesp. Alright, Wigglytuff is bond. Wigglytuff is gonna use Dark Pulse again. Alright, we just got some Gengar and some action, so let's go ahead and swap him out. Hmm, let's do... I don't really want us to go to Eevee, but let's go ahead and do Eevee. Do you have a Discord channel or anything for your channel? I do, actually. It's down in the bio and also down in the panel. Eevee avoided the move. I don't know what move it was, though. Okay, let's do... Glitching Glow. Bet. I, I do. It's down in the in the bio and or and down in the uh, panel actually. Alright, we got Dark Posts. Wiggly Tough is gonna get bun. 
I don't want to do double edge, but what we're going to do is we're going to do the sizzling slide. Take what's left of the HP that Wigglytuff has. There we go. 562 experiment points for Eevee, 702 for Gengar, and whatever the experiment points I get for the Pokemon that is in my party. We got an Ivy Sword coming in. I'm gonna keep Eevee in the mix. Let's do a Sizzling Slide. And that will one shot. Beautiful. Ivy Sword is fainted. 524 expand points for Eevee. Eevee's gonna level up to level 51. When enjoying, gonna check it out a bit later for me. It's all good. But thank you for joining the Discord, actually. Anyone can join. Also, uh, some Pokemon is in my party. Just gonna gain some expand points. Can't go just level up to level 40. No. Long. But think of it, the 740 Poké Dollars and the two Great Balls. Okay. Let's go ahead and uh, we do need to heal Eevee and Gengar. We got a gentleman with a poison there. We got an ace trainer with an exitor. Well, it's a good looking guy who is with a cute Pokemon. Ace Trainer Mela, you got three Pokemon. You got an Exitor coming in. I just literally just have my Eevee just chilling on my hat anyway. Alright, let's do. Grizzling Slide. I could have one sided it was super effective. Exitor is Bunt. Psychic from Exitor. Go ahead and get a Bunt there. Alright, let's do another Sizzling Slide. There we go. It was super effective. I know you could do it, Eevee. Actually, Tor is fainted. 743 expand points. And also, my Pokemon is going to gain some... And my partner is going to gain some expand points. Uh, Dragonite just leveled up to level 32. We got a Ninetales coming in. Yeah, we can keep Eevee. Because we got Bouncing Bubbles. Bouncing Bubble is going to heal up EB also. Oof, that was so close to one sighting. It was super effective. EB is going to heal. Ninetales is going to get its energy drain. We got a flamethrower coming through from Ninetales. Do one more Bouncing Bubble. Thank you, Flying Redone. Back to Bubble Sword Hunt and Let's Go Pikachu. Oh, nice. I did win. I I did win into one in a volume for you, actually. I right, was six hundred ninety experiment points for Eevee. Now, so with the Pokemon that is in my party, we got a Star Me coming in. Let's actually swap out from Eevee. Let's do Venusaur. I just randomly just ran into one in a volume for you, actually. Because I wasn't really expecting to uh, see one, because I do know you can get that one from uh, Solian City, actually. Let's do Petal Dance. Petal Dance will one side star me there. Star me is fainted. Yeah, it's a rare encounter. They'll take forever with a lag of chain it. Oh man. Venusaur is gonna level up to level 48. Pokemon in my team is gonna gain some experiment points too. Oops, did I just say that aloud? I think for the 3900 Pokedollars and the 5 Ultra Balls. I'm pretty sure you did. Pretty sure you did. 
I would do more um, signing training if I actually did start it up Scarlet and or uh, Violet at slaves battle this gentleman here. Are you a bad kid or a good kid? What do you mean about that by like strength wise or like in general gentleman or Shen? You got one Pokemon we do know it that is the Porzen. Bring out Eevee. Let's do double edge. That will one shot. Person is fainted. I started signing hunting with Legends Arceus and then Scarlet. I actually did start it from Legends Arceus also. Olsen has been defeated? No. You're a great kid, but think for the 4500 and 60 Poké Dollars and the 3 Pokéballs. I do need to get back into Legends Arceus actually, and do like more of the side quests. Got a beauty here. I need a little exercise. We do know that you have a Weeping Bell on your team. Uh, that's for sure. Beauty Samantha. Yeah, it's only one Pokémon that is a Weeping Bell. Like my first well encounter, like no, Sunny encounter in Legends Arceus was a Sunny uh, Gibble, actually. I actually have a clip of it on TikTok and on my uh, YouTube shorts, actually. That sizzling slide with one side, Wimbin Bell, then. Charles Sword is gonna level up to level 45. Thank you, Samantha, for that battle. Phew, good workout. But thank you for the 2220 Poké Dollars and the 3 Poké Balls. Love the spark of noise when they pop up on scene. I wish that they could stay in other, ga in other games. Uh, my first Sunny was a Do Spider and Sunny Moon. Ooh. I want to play through um, Sun and Moon, but I do not know how I'm going to do that actually on stream. Like for real. There's a notice post here. Don't throw the game. Throw Pokeballs instead. Oh, that's hilarious. We got a tiny Dudro there. Got a hidden item here. That is a five silver pronoun berries. Okay. I love that they actually keep the cycling world music. Round 17 to Sildon City to Felicia City. Ooh, we got a trainer coach here. We got a whale candy here. Pokemon World is smoother, isn't it? Hmm, oh sorry, I s spaced out. I'm a coach trainer, did you want to have a battle? Yes, let's go ahead. Okay, I'm ready. I just now people go and use like um, emulators for that. I do know too much of those um, besides uh, the tenor doesn't like them. Well, unfortunately, I do use emulators for majority of my um, Pokemon playthroughs anyway on a on the channel and also on stream also. Got a coach training gently. You got three Pokemon. Got a Pharaoh. Yeah, I do know that Detano doesn't really like it. But technically, Detano does not like anyone streaming the games. They actually said it down back in Trini Trini, but there's nothing that they can do about that. Because um, they know where all the money's, well, like, where they can get the money's at is um, from people that watch streamers, actually. There was a lot of drama about that back in Trini Trini, anyway, down COVID. <laughs> We're gonna use Glitchly Glow. And it's gonna faint, Pharaoh. Well, that you don't know, don't like promoting for your game. The Pokemon's gonna my, gonna gain some experience points. I don't really know how many um experience points if we actually this game. We got a B drill here. Gonna keep battering. Are we do gonna use um sizzling slide. That will one-shot. 
It was super effective. Beedrill is fainted. Eevee's gonna gain 700 Trebek expand points. It's also the Pokemon that is in my party. We got a Sin Slash coming in. Gonna keep Eevee in the mix. I don't mind. Um, there's, it's just like Pokemon. There's like that one uh, type franchise that I always wanted to do as like a YouTube series and also on stream. I just had to figure out a way to do it. Just recording, like, just recording off your phone for your 3DS, it's just gonna be so crappy as crap. You're strong, you're great, but thank you for the 4100 Poke Dollars, though, coach. I do appreciate it. It was fun. I think you'll be able to put this to good use. TM58, drill one. Gonna add that to the TM case. Uh, TM51 is for Drill 1. It's this drilly move that has a higher chance of scoring a critical hit. Thank you. Got another... Um... Sign here. Trainer tips. When you catch a Pokemon, try to throw your Pokemon inside the colored wing. Get a nice throw or great throw based on how small the wing is to make catching Pokemon a breeze. Wow, I actually could have read this sign before I actually did the Pokemon Go part because we were throwing Pokemon's left and right. Hey, we got a Rabidas here. No matter, we already have a Rabidas, but um, let's go ahead and catch it. I, mm, that's what we've been dealing with all episode, last episode. I had no ideas, I had no clues what we were talking about. We was talking about, um... Detando, actually. 352 experience point from catching that level, that's... Blastoise is gonna level up to level 45. About, uh, Detando doesn't really like them playing the, like... People like streaming or playing, like, basically like stream of the games. That was back then, COVID. We got a punk guy here with a primate. Be a rebel. Uh, that's what we was actually was talking about. Punk guy Kobe, you got two Pokemon. Got a primate. Let's do Sissing Slide. Okay, could have one sided. The Primate is born. Primate is going to use U Turn. It's not really going to do anything to Eevee though. Alright, Cory is going to bring out the Grabbler here. Going to use a Bouncing Bubble. That will one shot. It was super effective. I know you could do it, Eevee. Just gonna gain that pent up health that we just lost from that primate earlier. From that U turn. Graveler is fainted. 520 experience points for Eevee, also with the Pokemon that is in my party. Alright, here comes the primate again. Just keep Eevee in the mix. Hmm, let's do... Glittering Glow. Why, why, that's a little crazy because streamers are how younger people find Pokemon now. True. Pyman is fainted. I could watch, like, um, United Gamer and, uh, PM7 play, which is why I got Scarlet. Alright, Dragonite is gonna level up to level 33. Thank you, Cory, for the battle. Ah, uh, but thank you for the 1,064 Pokedons and the three Pokeballs. Here's the thing: a lot of streamers does use emulators for the Pokemon playthroughs, anyway. So I know that Nintendo doesn't like it, but it's really common in in the streaming industry. Actually, we got a, a elixir here because you probably can go into like each Pokemon. 
playthrough of someone like someone streaming it it's gonna be on an emulator anyway got a sign here trainer tips all pokemon are unique even pokemons of the same species and level gold at different weights which adds up in time we got two ptotos here get a ace trainer with a war total here Please, would you have a battle with my babies? Yeah, for real, I use them for like Pokemon Amble and uh, G uh, Game Boy events games. That's what I did for um for my playthroughs actually. Uh, he has uh, three Pokemon. We do know that one is a War Total here. Uh, let's do double edge because I did use an emulator for my playthrough of yellow, crystal, emerald, fire red. The only Pokemon series I do have. Also, I did play through diamond also. Um, and also like the only ones that is on the Switch is Legends Arceus and this actually. Alright, let's do Glitch and Glow. Please battle my babies, please. Uh, actually destroy my cute Pokemon and make me pay for it in return. Some of these downloads can be a little crazy, actually. Eevee's gonna gain 568 expand points also with the Pokemon that is in my party. Gengar is gonna level up to level 41. We got a Magaton coming in. Yeah, we can keep uh, Eevee in the mix. Some of the dialogues back in like in the older games was more hardcore actually. It's like crazy. But Sizzling Slide will one side Magneton. Magneton is fainted. 635 expand points for even also with the Pokemon that is in my party. We get a Mortowag coming in. Yeah, let's keep Eevee in the mix. Alright, we should use Bouncing Bubbles. Could have one-shotted, but it is what it is. Eevee's gonna heal up some health. Mottowise is gonna get his energy drain. His walk slides coming through from Mottowack. Alright, let's do Glitching Glow. I gotta head out for a while, my boyfriend wants to call. I'll be back around later, or next time you stream though. But thank you for stopping by, uh, Plague Life. I do appreciate it. And then, have a good night, actually. Eevee's gonna level up to level 52. And also with the Pokemon that is in my party. Thank you, Ace Trainer Johnson, for that battle. Even if they lost, my babies are still cute. But thank you for the 3,900 Poké Dollars and the 5 Ultra Balls. Thanks for letting me hang out. Have a good day and night. You too. You have a good day and night yourself. And thank you for stopping by, actually. I do appreciate it. Alright, we got another sign here. There's a notice post here. Be on the lookout for discard items. Talk about that. We got a... This card item here that is a super lore. We got a Radicate here. We got another Dodoro. Got a Lance with a Flareon here. Let me see your Pokemon, please. Well, at least we're making our way over to Seldon City. Got a Lance Mala. You got one Pokemon that is the Flareon. Because we can buy a Firestone, so we can actually evolve that Eevee that we got from Go Part to Flareon, actually. And that's like the only Eevee evolution that I just need. And we got them all, actually. Now, they're like low level, but still. I'm gonna use Bounce Bubble on supplies that did not one sight. Okay. Hey, Flavion's going to use Double Kick. It's a critical hit. It was super effective. It hit two times. Yeah, we just bouncing bubbles again. Good to know that this world is not the second world. It's actually called Pokemon World. 
Yeah, Flareon is fainted. Yeah, we're gonna gain 661 expand points to toss up with the Pokemon that is in my party. Thank you, Mala, for that battle. I'm happily... I'm happy now. But thank you for the 720 Poke Dollars and the 3 Pokeballs. For the people that are watching this, yes, I do stream while recording my series playthroughs, actually. Got a beauty here with a Jolteon. Oh, you a little cutie, so like a darling Pokemon. Beauty Alexis, you can add one Pokemon, that is the Jolteon. Let's do Gritly Glow. Is it landed a critical hit? My scream is gonna make the team much stronger. Got pan missiles coming from uh, Jotion. It's gonna hit two times. Do Sizzling Slide. There we go. Jutrion is fainting. 680 expand points for even. Also with the Pokemon that is in my party. Thank you, Alexis, for that battle. I was caught off guard. But thank you for the 2200 and 20 Poke Dollars and 3 Pokeballs. We got a Pignacle here with a Vaporeon. Do you want to battle my Pokemon? A matter of fact, I do, actually. I won't be talking to you if I didn't, Pignacle Adala. Uh, you do have one Pokemon, that is that Vaporeon. What I think what we may need is a... Venusaur to be... Oops, one tap. I think we need a Venusaur in the mix here. V Vaporeon is going to use a double kick. It's a critical hit, it's not really effective, but it hit two times. Okay, let's do a... Pedal Dance. I don't know why, I just like Pedal Dance. It will one shot. It was super effective. That's it, I know you could do it. Vaporeon is fainted. Venus is just gonna gain 680 expand points, same as even, also with the Pokemon that is in my party. Thank you, Dollar, for that battle. Ah, uh, but thank for the 740 Poke Dollars and the two Great Balls. We got a... Hidden item here that is a super potion. What is that? Oh, it's a uh, light post. Okay, I actually thought there was something in the water there. We got a camper here. Whoa, you have great Pokemon. Let me see. I do have a Dragonite and a Gengar. I haven't really been using it yet, but uh, Camper Warden, you got two Pokemon, but I may be using it on. Your Pokemon, actually. Got a Psyduck here. We had to bring the EB out right quick. What level is the Psyduck? It's level 35? Let's bring out Dragonite. Get Dragonite some ads in. Then. Psyduck is going to use Fairy Swipe. It hit three times. Alright, we got Dragon Tail and Dragon Waves of Agility and Thunder Wave. Side that is gonna hit force. It hit three times. Dragon Tail from Dragonite. Uh, side that is going to avoid the attack. Do Dragon Waves this time. Dragonite is gonna use Dragon Mage. Side that is gonna use Fairy Swipe. It hit three times. Uh, Thunder Wave is only going to make Pearly, uh, make Psyduck Paralyze anyway. 
inside that's gonna use disabled. Dragon Raid was disabled. Okay, let's do Dragon Tail then. Inside that it's gonna use Side Beam. Side that it's gonna avoid the attack. Use Dragon Tail again. Side Beam from Side Deck. Dragon Tail from Dragonite is actually gonna hit this time. Side Deck is fainted. Dragonite is going to gain 279 experiments, and Eevee is going to gain 223 experiment points. Warden had another side deck coming in. Let's actually swap out from Dragonite, and let's bring out Gengar. Alright, here comes side deck. Mm, let's do dog pulse. That will one side. It's a critical hit. Side deck is fainted. 279 experience points for Gingo and also with the Pokemon that is in my party. Thank you, Warden, for that battle. The code is so shiny. But think for the 700 Poke Dollars and the two great balls. I do appreciate that, Camper. But we got two hidden items here. We got a super potion here. And also, we got a, another hidden item here. That is three great balls. Alright, we do see a two pump guys and a breaker guy there. And that's the house where we can normally get fly from. But we are finally at the gate to Sildon City. So we're just gonna make our way out right quick. And also, we just had to make our way around. Ooh, we got a... A trio here. We got another Snorlax. We can catch. Let's go ahead and catch this the trio right quick. Do I have any berries? Uh, yes, a matter of fact, I do. I have five simple Napa berries that we can definitely can use. Alright, let's see what this the duo can chill out just a little bit. Alright, we got a great there. Nice, it's gonna catch. The duo has been caught. We're gonna get in 815 experience points. We're gonna get three Mighty Candies, two large Mighty Candies, and one XL Mighty Candies. Dragonite is gonna level up to level 34. That place we're gonna get the drill data has been added to the Pokedex. One of the duo's two head splits to form a unique style. It won close to 40 mouse powers and fairies. Gonna add it to the Pokemon box. Got a hidden item here. Get a PP up. Nice. Got a little PP up there. Alright, let's watch over the Pokemon here. I don't want to encounter them actually. If there is like any Pokemon that we have in an encounter, I will go after them, but just gonna bypass them. It's gonna go through this top part of the gate here. We're actually gonna go see what we can do with the house here. Because normally this will we can normally get fly from got a chick here. Oh dear, you found my secret retreat. Please don't tell anyone I'm here. I'll make it up to you with this. Okay, we, we do get fly here. Okay. TM14 fly. I do appreciate it actually. Don't think we can actually use it like a special HM like all of the other Pokemon games. But while we have that... Ooh, let's actually let uh, Dragonite learn Thunderbolt right quick. We're actually going to do our TM back right quick. Let's get rid of Thunder Wave. Trying to see if um, Dragonite or uh, Gengar can learn better moves, actually. Um, I 
I heard Grizzly and Glam is good. So I guess we can let Gengar learn it right quick. It is a fairy type move. Hmm, let's just get rid of with a Wasp. I think that we should do. Okay. Dragonite can use a Solve. Or a Fire Punch. I'm trying to get Dragonite some better moves, actually, if you guys know what I mean. Let's get rid of the agility. I know Flying is going to be one of the moves that we probably get a uh, Charizard or a Dragonite, actually. Yeah, let's actually let Charizard and Dragonite learn it, like, quick. Something a little bit better than what we currently got. Alright, let's give it a ring attack here. Swap it out with Fly. There we go. Charizard pick out ring attack and learn Fly instead. And also let's use it on Dragonite. Would be uh, I like Dragon Rage a little bit better, so let's get with a Dragon Tail. Actually, I do like Dragon Rage a lot more better, to be honest. Alright, cool. Got some punk guys here. What do you want? I want a battle, actually. That's what I'm here for. Punk guy Leo, you got two Pokemon. You got an Onyx. I feel like we haven't seen Onyx in a crazy minute, actually. Now he's just bouncing bubble. That was one shot. Beautiful. It was super effective. That's it. I know you could do it, Eevee. That place Eevee is gonna heal up its its HP. Onyx is fainted. Eevee is going to gain 485 expand points also with the Pokemon that is in my party. We got a Muk coming in. We switch out Eevee to Gengar. Yeah. Swap out to Gengar. We got a Muk coming in. We still dark posts. Monk has flinched. Nice. We still use glittering glam and see what that does. Hmm, it's not really affected, but Monk is gonna use sludge. It's not really effective. Let's do saddle ball this time. That will thank Monk. Monk is fainted. 787 expand points for Gingo and also with the Pokemon that is in my party. Thank you, Leo, for that battle. Don't you dare laugh. But thank you for the 1,008 Poke Dollars and the 3 Pokeballs. Take out this punk guy here. Hey, you just spawned me. Actually, you just. Turn around just right when I got to you there, bud. Punk Guide Hido. You got two Pokemon. You got an Arbok. Hey, let's use Glitching Glow. That will one shot. It was super effective. I know you could do it, Eevee. Arbok is fainted. Light screens make the team lot much stronger. 564 experience for Eevee, and also with the Pokemon that is in my party. Gengar is going to level up to level 42. We got a Pharaoh coming in. Yeah, let's actually keep Eevee in the mix. Alright, let's use. Sizzling slide. Could have one sided. I could have one sided Eevee. Fairy is going to use Fairy. Fairy arrow. It hit three times. That plus Fairy is going to get hurt by the bond there. 
Alright, let's use Sizzling Slide. There we go. Ferret is painted. 557 expand points. For Eevee, Venusaur is gonna level up to level 49. What's going on, Game of Mad? How are you? Vlad's Plazor is gonna level up to level 46. Kaboom! Thank you for the 1,008 Poke Dollars and the three Poke Dollars. Three Poke Balls still high though. I do appreciate it. Nice Pokemon. Hand them over. Alright, we got a Roughneck, Kuji. You got three Pokemon. You got a Radicate. Alright, let's go ahead and use a sizzling slide on Radicate here. That could have one sided. I'm surprised that it didn't. Have a veins coming through from Radicate. I'm pretty sure that bone would faint Radicate them. It definitely will. Radicate is fainted now. 521 expand points for Eben, also with the Pokemon that is in my party. Kuji's gonna bring out a coughing. Let's keep Eevee in the mix. Alright, let's do... Double Edge. That one-sided. Coughing is fainted. Eevee's going to take some recoil damage, but Eevee's going to gain 244 expand points, and also with the Pokemon that is in my party. Kuji got a Lion Horn, which actually keep Eevee in the mix. And we are going to do a Bouncing Bubble on this Lion Horn here. That will one it. Beautiful. It was super effective. That's it. I know you could do it. Beautiful, that place Eevee is going to elevate its HP, Rhinehorn is fainted. Eevee is going to gain 247 expand points, it's also with the Pokemon that is in my party is going to gain some also. Knocked out. Thank you for the 1008 Poke Dollars and the 3 Pokeballs still Kuji, I do appreciate it. I'm pretty sure that is all of the trainers here on uh, Night Cycling Road. Well, technically it's a Pokemon world actually, but you guys do know that we do have a notice Snorlax right up here before we actually make our way into uh, Celeborn... Celeborn City. Go ahead and chop this tree down. A Pokemon is thrown out in a deep and comfortable slumber. Do you want to use the Pokemon? Pokeflute? Yes, I'm out like I do. No matter, we did manage to catch a Snorlax back in the last episode, but we can try to catch another one. If this one doesn't want to run away, actually. Snorlax have walked up. Snorlax mistook you for food and attacked. Alright, this is going to be time to Snorlax defense's woes, because if you guys do remember back on on episode 15 that it is time by five minutes we still double edge we had to battle it and then we can be able to catch it Eevee is going to take some recoil damage Snorlax is going to use yawn that's going to make Eevee drowsy okay let's do double edge again that will f not really faint Snorlax, but that's going to transfer the battle over to be able to catch Snorlax. Now let's give it a civil Pernout Berry. Get a great throw there. Okay, what is same? It could be, it was close to being caught too. I was a little bit to the right, but at least it's still in the catching area. Alright, we managed to get a second Snorlax. I take it, I take it. Gonna gain 393 expand points for catching that Snorlax. 
That was our second Snorlax, I take it. And Snorlax is gonna be tucked away into the Pokemon box. And here we are, back in that Celeborn City. Before we actually do end this episode actually, you guys know what I'm planning on doing. I'm gonna be making my way up to the floor that sells the stones right quick. And we're going to involve the Eevee that we met as the cats back in the Go Park actually. And uh, bob it to our Flareon actually. It's at this floor. Yes, a matter of fact, it is. Okay, let's go ahead and buy a Firestone. There we go. That's all I needed, bud. Now we're going to take the elevator back down to the service counter. And we're gonna make our way out of the department store. We just need to go over to my Pokemon box right quick. And find that Eevee where we caught in the last episode. Alright, there it is. It's a level 29 Eevee. We're gonna add it to the party right quick. Which is just Shut up, Dragonite, right quick. This is gonna be a little quick, little evolving here. Eevee is evolving. Yeah, I did notice that the normal Eevee's eyes are brown, and the Eevee that we managed to get throughout the beginning, or since the beginning of the series, is actually pink. I did notice that actually. Now we know what um. Cute salmon was talking about back in uh, episode 15. What y'all been talking about back in episode 15? Congratulations, your EB has been bobbed to Flareon. Flareon data has been added to the Pokedex. It has a flame chamber inside its body. It inhales and breathes out fire that is over 3000 degrees Fahrenheit. That blitz Eevee wants to learn to move Amber. Okay, we just let Eevee, um, Eevee, uh, Flareon lose Amber. Yeah, um, let's give it some of these moves, actually. No, man, we're not gonna use Flareon, but we just wanted it for the Pokedex entry. If you guys know what I mean. Nice. Now we're actually gonna... Get Flareon out, so let's make our way back over to Dragon Knight. I'm gonna add you back to the party there, bud. There we go. Nice, chat. Nice, nice, nice. Now we are here in Cedarbon City. No matter, there's not really anything we need to do here in Cedarbon. Eevee? We need to fly back over to Felicia City because in the next episode actually we'll be making my way down to see from Allen to Silliborn Allen so we're gonna take a little fly dash here back to Felicia City and also I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode here guys hope you guys did enjoy this episode if you guys are liking this series so far make sure you hit that like button hit that subscribe button also, the the bell, you get noise every single time that I do upload the video. If you have not watched any of the past Let's Go EB videos, the playlist is down in the description with all of my social media. I think this is going to be more my the set team, actually. To make our way to the Elite Four. But anyway, guys, hope you guys enjoyed. i see you guys in the next Let's Go EB video. Peace, guys.